Did you know that your choice of study can directly impact your employability and sponsorship prospects? Hi guys, today I'm talking about another exciting topic, how you can secure UK visa sponsorship jobs faster by choosing the right courses. Stick around to the end because you're going to learn a lot of stuff you never knew about. As usual, information is based on my own personal experiences, observation, and research undertaken. Guys, you are welcome to my world, Jenny's UK Experience. If you are new here, thank you for choosing this video. On this channel, I share my experiences and knowledge about life in the UK. Have you subscribed to my channel yet? I need your encouragement, so please hit the subscribe button like and share as well to my amazing subscribers lots of kisses getting a sponsorship job in the uk isn't just about having a degree it's about having the degree that aligns with high demand skills the uk government regularly updates a shortage occupation list now called the immigration salary list which highlights professions in high demand and in shortage with a reduced salary threshold or requirement. Employers are more willing to sponsor international employees for roles in these areas because they face a talent gap. By studying courses related to these fields, you are positioning yourself as an ideal candidate for sponsorship. So let's take a look at the top five job industries you should consider studying in 2025. The first on my list is nursing and healthcare courses. On the government's websites, link as shown on the screen, there's a long list of healthcare professions or occupations that are eligible for health and care worker visa. Try and research courses in line with these healthcare professions. These professions are in high demand and, and require a lower salary requirement. These professions include biochemists and biomedical scientists, physical and biological scientists, generalists or specialist medical professionals or practitioners, physiotherapists, occupational therapists, speech and language therapists, clinical psychologists, pharmacists, nurses in all fields, laboratory technician. Have some time and go through this list to inform your decision for course selection. Pursuing a degree in these fields mostly guarantees a job offer with visa sponsorship. Next on my list is social work. Both children and adult social workers in UK are in very high demand. If you have a passion for helping others, consider studying social work. Many local authorities in the UK hire social workers already in the UK and overseas as well with visa sponsorship. Trust me, I personally know, know lots of many you know, friends who got this opportunity. Social work programs often provide students with hands-on experience through placements in various settings such as schools, hospitals and community. You can consider studying a degree or postgraduate degree in social work to secure a visa sponsorship fast after graduating. Please note that aside courses in healthcare fields, there are other occupations or professions that may not be on the immigration salary list but are in high demand. On the 19th September 2024, the government published a report known as the Occupations in Demand 2024. This is the link to the report as shown on the screen. Please take time and go through these professions and choose courses that align with these professions. Key indicators used to determine the occupations in demand was the number of visa sponsorship applications made, change in hourly wages, online job adverts, etc. Some key professions highlighted by this report are as follows. This would be the third on our list. They are the programmers and software developers. Guys, these professionals are sought after. Seriously in high demand with visa sponsorship job opportunities available. 
Companies are looking for individuals skilled in programming languages like Python, Java, C++, and JavaScript. Consider studying courses in software engineering, artificial intelligence, and machine learning, data science and data analytics, cybersecurity, cloud computing, etc. to increase your chances of getting a visa sponsorship first. Beyond earning these degrees, consider acquiring specialized certifications in these fields to enhance your expertise and career opportunities. The fourth on our list is the teaching profession. This includes secondary education, teaching secondary education teaching professionals, teaching assistants, and higher education teaching professionals according to the report. There is particularly a high demand for teachers specializing in early childhood education at the primary or secondary level, special education needs, and many more. Consider studying courses in education at degree or postgraduate level to secure yourself a visa sponsorship. If this is your line of interest, Research further into this field as some of the courses may not guarantee a teacher qualification. The fifth on my list is engineering. Guys, there's consistent demand for skilled engineers across various disciplines, making this field a hotspot for sponsorship opportunities. Fields like civil, mechanical, electrical, aerospace, chemical engineering play a vital role in the construction, trades, and healthcare industries. They drive innovation and support the development of critical infrastructure, making them indispensable to the global competition. Consider studying courses in these engineering fields to secure a visa sponsorship first. Aside these five industries mentioned above, the report highlights many other in-demand professions that I could not cover here. I encourage you to take a look at the report yourself as your field of interest might be among them. This is the link to the report as shown on the screen. Guys, I pray the Lord leads you and directs you in your course selection so that you don't waste your money and efforts. Please support my efforts by hitting the like, share and subscribe button. And as usual and as always, feel free to leave your questions or thoughts in the comment section below. I would love to hear from you. See you in my next video. Bye.